Good boy. Good boy. Sussex, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. Yeah. Yeah. Well, one yeah. week of being home and he's starting to trust us. Yeah. Yeah. Letting us get the belly rubs yeah. in. Yeah. Yeah. When did he first do that for me? Was it yesterday or the day before? The day before. Yeah, two days ago. He did that the first day I met him. Hmm. <laughs> no, not like that. Nice just, try, bud. He wagged his little tail out of that. Man. He said, ooh, I won't go home with that guy. That's what mama did when she first let, met me. She wagged her little tail. <laughs> well, mama's tail fell off. What? Yeah, Mama wagged her tail so much, it fell off. Nice. Because Mama's a human. Because Mama's a human, yeah. Tail. <laughs> oh, I see what you're saying now. That was actually funny. You have sophisticated jokes like your Mama. Go with Nick. Next one. See, that's about 10. Cut them that way. Well, they need to be about an inch right there. By the time I put them on the lays, round them out. So, oh, so I do six there. It should be six and six. Be 12, 12 sticks I get out of that board right there. And I swear I come right up to a rattlesnake. He's already. He told me he was there when I was here. Oh, yeah. He heard me coming. You know, with the tap, tap, tap. Yeah. And uh, I don't know. There's something about it when you're when you're walking with the stick. It just kept all the bad things away. And yeah. it's almost biblical. Who was it, David? No, uh, David, Jabel, the shepherd. Jabel, Jabel. Jabel, the shepherd. Jabel had that staff. <laughs> For the bear, for the wolf, for the snake, you know. He tapped the ground. Tapped the ground, yeah. And that's each of these kids when they go in the woods. Yeah. You know, I tell them about my walking stick and I want to personalize them for them, you know. I'm getting old, Pops. No kidding. You're telling me I'm getting gray hair. No kidding. The <laughs> what are you going to look like when you get my age? Well, hopefully it's good as you, Pops. <laughs> <laughs> when you get tired, how? Oh. I'm gonna be all right, pops. If you if you're not tired, then I can't be tired. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Pops, do you remember taking that class with Rob? Oh yeah. You do? Yeah. Unbelievable. How yeah. old were you? Were you really 70? Yeah. Wow. I um. You see the cabinet I made up there? The cabinet up here? Yeah. Me and Rob both made one like that. Oh my, at that class you did? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I was glad to take it, man. So was that something you wanted to do, or did Rob find the class and then you you went with him? No, I think I found it. And then I didn't have a wheel. Uh -huh. And he had the wheel, so I talked to him. 
you know, for me and him were up for the day. And so uh, we just said we was going, and so it was cost of a hundred dollars. Wow. But Back was then. Worth it that matter of, man. Wow. So you, you get these little tricks, you know, that you don't want to ever get anywhere else. So I was glad to get it. That's amazing. Okay, well, do you remember how to do that? Oh, yeah. I don't put on a whole lot since I've got that thing. Your wheel is stuck back here. Yeah, I just blew a bunch of dust back at you. Somebody just asked us on our live the other day, has Monica made anything that no one has ever liked or yeah. eaten? Thank you. I'm sitting here You're talking like, to her, staring one. at her beauty, because I'm really <laughs> distracted by the way, but nice. Nice. I just realized she cracked eggs over this sourdough pizza. And I looked over and said, is that egg? So, I mean, I obviously trust her and I'm sure it's gonna be delicious, but this might be a thing. <laughs> that we will have to tell you next week. Yeah, that just didn't fly. That did not fly. But I have a funny feeling this thing is gonna be magically delicious. It's gonna work. Babe. It's gonna work. Have I ever told you that I loved you? No. I love you. <laughs> I love you. We've been doing this thing a long time. We're gonna be doing it a lot longer. I was about to call you M Strong like you call me D Strong. <laughs> I worked hard for that last name. Oh boy. You had that last name on the first conversation we ever had. I worked hard to keep that last name. I worked hard to keep the last name because I wanted to ditch the last name. Yeah, you wanted thing. to ditch that thing, Just but you know what? I literally was just about to say, if you dished me, you still would have kept my name because you wouldn't want nobody else to take it. Um, here we go. Yeah. Uh, uh, Didn't you leave him 10 B. years ago? But still, that's still my name. Get up off him. <laughs> and then I would be like, babe, we gonna get back together? No, bye. <laughs> Y'all, we have a story. And maybe on one of the lives, we won't get into the details, but every marriage has a story. Don't lie, you got one too. Um, Every marriage that's still together. And so we've been years. through it. We've been through the fire. We've been okay. refined. I've been refined. I've had my David moments that I'm begging God to create in me a clean heart. But, you know, everybody has a story. And the beautiful thing the key is, is that you have those moments. Yeah. Yeah. The key you gotta is have. That you actually yeah, you gotta actually have those moments. Your face and... But um, if you don't give up on the story, the last chapter it is, is always so worth it. It's always sweet. It's it, so it, it always it. turns out to be a best-selling novel. So don't give up. Keep working on your story. Don't let chapter 12 define what your whole book is about. And they say it starts in the kitchen. See, he hangs out in the oh, kitchen. Oh, wow, well, well, I was taking notes. I let was taking this notes. Be a, let this be a, yeah, a anyway. key point for those of you. Anyway, y'all ask when we get time. We, we get time right now, see? This is all the 10 sure. minutes we need. Our time of refueling, somebody else asks us that. Monica, when do you ever get 10 minutes alone and all this stuff? We're weird, y'all. We explain a lot about that. We're just different. We're wired differently. But if we get time alone, I mean, it's good. We get some things done. It's productive. But, like, yeah, our like time together is what is what really refuels us. It's like we don't refuel by getting away, doing a guy's night or a girl's night or girl's day out. I'm sure she had fun doing all that. But if I was there with her doing that, I'm that just speaking for you. 
it would have been like that and so same thing for me it's like if yeah. we get to go what are, this together in the kitchen right now this is refueling us and this is our time that we get to get away and this is what we need we don't need to tuck ourselves away in a closet and pray that we're going to make it another day i mean we could also do that <laughs> she does that a lot but anyway no she's joking <laughs> but this is it our time alone is our time together we were just made for each other. God knew what he was doing when he stitched this story together. He's like, this was not gonna be able to be separated, so. And this is a secret ingredient. We just had it on a gourmet pizza a couple weeks ago. They drizzled honey over it. It was delicious. I do it without anybody looking though. <laughs> Cause you know, everybody would be skeptical, but. It was divine. I think it looks delicious. That is a beautiful margarita pizza. Where's my margarita? Oh man. man. Well, let's see what Dada thinks. That sounds like a day late and a dollar short oh my word i can't believe it. i'm the first guinea pig of this thing you should feed it to the kids they're honest i'll tell you it's delicious oh thanks <laughs> oh my there goodness he sat the whole time you are such a good boy oh has anybody ever had an egg on their pizza it's breakfast pizza cheers no. Never. lisa oh, made hot. it too hot she said her kids loved it good. It also had bacon on theirs, so that's probably why. He like well, they put pineapple on it. Oh, yeah. Ew! Yeah, exactly. No, I know, but I would not eat pineapple. That's amazing. Guys, the worst yeah. thing for me would be pineapple with red sauce and cheese. That people do it. It's called a Hawaiian. Gabriella, did you get money from Pop Pops? Yeah. Did you sweep his shop? Let me see your money. So Do you know how much money that is? Did you count it? Yeah. Mama, help you count it. One, two. Three. You big girls, you made some money today. I'm very proud of you. Good job. Get a dog for me.